do vitamin patches work? From the time of the Flintstones to today's gummies and chocolate, vitamins have evolved in various ways. Now, there's a new way to get your vitamins, through patches you stick on your skin. These vitamin patches, also called transdermal patches, are easy to find online from places like PatchMD, PatchAid, NutriPatch, and many more on Amazon and wellness-focused websites. They say their vitamin formulas, which the FDA doesn't regulate or test, go directly into your bloodstream. Most of these companies say the patches are great because they avoid problems like food allergies. But here's the catch. There's not much proof that these patches actually do what they claim. So, does vitamin formulation matter? While transdermal patches are known to be effective for delivering certain medications like nicotine or birth control, there's not much proof that they work well for vitamins. Our skin has seven layers, and most topical products, like skincare items, only go through the outermost layer called the stratum corneum. The size and solubility of the particles matter. Smaller molecules can penetrate deeper, especially if they dissolve in fat rather than water. Drugs like scopolamine, nicotine, fentanyl, or some birth control chemicals, which are small and fat-soluble, can go through a patch and enter the bloodstream. Vitamins could potentially be delivered through the skin, but only if they were formulated as nanoparticles and enclosed in a fat-soluble substance. The challenge is that, since vitamins aren't regulated by the FDA, it's hard to know if the patches contain these formulations. In summary, there's not much evidence supporting the effectiveness of transdermal patches for delivering vitamins as of now. Clinical research raises further doubts about vitamin patches. The idea of using transdermal vitamin patches is interesting, especially for post-operative bariatric patients with limited stomach capacity. These patients could benefit from getting vitamin supplements through the skin. However, a study tested serum nutrient levels in patients using a multivitamin patch for 3, 6, and 12 months. At the end, 19% of participants had vitamin D and B6 deficiencies, while others developed deficiencies in vitamin B1, folate, and zinc. Another study on bariatric patients using patch-delivered multivitamins also showed vitamin D deficiencies after a year. The only positive finding so far is a small pilot study with 30 healthy adults demonstrating successful administration of vitamin D3 via a patch and improvements in vitamin D status for all participants. So is there a potential for harm? It's important to know about the potential toxicity of some vitamins in excessive amounts. However, concerns about overdosing through vitamin patches might not be a practical worry. We decided to try the patches ourselves but had a nightmarish experience. Our micronutrient tests before and after using the patch showed no change, and some of us experienced a bad reaction to the adhesive of the patch, leading to contact dermatitis. Based on this experience, we suggest that there is a lack of research behind vitamin patches, considering them more of a trend that needs evaluation and research. We advise consumers to be cautious and stay away from such products until more research is conducted. So, what does this mean for you? While vitamin patches might seem like a convenient solution, their current form may provide little benefit beyond a placebo effect, and there's a potential for skin irritation in some cases. If you suspect a vitamin deficiency, it's advisable to consult with your doctor to determine the most effective and safe way to supplement your diet. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Watch more videos by clicking on this video right over here.